Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, with the release of the Windows 11 23H2 Patch Tuesday update that started rolling out yesterday on the 12th, KB504663, which I posted on, that video will be linked down below and in the end screen, there are reports now doing the rounds online, and I've also seen since early this morning in my region in the comments on the channel that a lot of Viewers running 23H2 are confused because they are seeing this message show up after installing the update. Get the newer version of Windows to stay up to date. Your version of Windows has reached the end of service and you can click on that link to learn more. Now, if you are seeing this, um, you're not alone. There are numerous reports now doing the rounds online and just posting this quick video just to get everybody on the same page. Now, According to Microsoft, they have confirmed that there is nothing wrong with your system and the issue is currently being investigated and will be fixed and possibly using a server-side update. Now, what you can do, as I always say, um, with little issues on your system, what you can do is you can try logging out or even restarting your device. Don't shut it down, restart. Maybe do that a couple of times and there is a good chance that this little bug, this little error warning, um, that's not actually real. It's just for what Microsoft is call, calling a reporting error. So try restarting your device and it may disappear. And obviously, um, if a fix does become available or that server-side update does roll out, obviously, when I get information of that, I will um, keep you guys posted. And if we just head over to um, Microsoft Docs, the Windows 11 Home and Pro life cycle, just to kind of put your mind at ease so we can get it in black and white. Um, version 23H2, end of support, November the 11th, 2025. So <laughs> um, that's basically a whole year um, early. So Microsoft is calling it a reporting issue. Um, I don't know, maybe somebody just got their dates mixed up, but nonetheless, um, that that uh, that banner that's popping up for 23H2 users can easily be ignored. You can ignore the alert. Um, 23H2 only ends support in about a year's time on the 11th of November next year, 2025. And as mentioned, if I get any info, I'll keep you guys in the loop. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.